Hey, Garrett Bro here. So today I have something pretty exciting to talk about. The uh, I've been testing the Autel Evo platform for the last few months in public safety scenarios. Uh, it's performed really well. I'll have some. Uh, I'll be uploading videos over the next few days uh, and weeks so that you can digest those and and see if it's something that uh, fits the needs for your agency. Uh, but today, what I want to talk about is displays on the Autel Evo. So the first thing I want to talk about is. The, a lot of people may not be aware of this, but um, you know, we talk about smart controllers and all this stuff having a built-in display. The controller, uh, Evo control itself has the ability, it has a nice OLED uh, display that's fully functional. And so you don't even have to have any kind of display mounted to it. Now, the challenge with that is some people, you, you don't have any push controls to, you know, a lot of people want to go and check on status and all this kind of stuff and this thing isn't a touch display. And the other thing is anybody knows that using a cell phone on a drone is horrible. I don't know how else to say it. If, if it's all you know, um, <laughs> I'd say it this way, but I feel sorry for you. If, it's, uh, if you've ever used one and then you use something better, then uh, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Now, when I say something better, what am I talking about? Of course, the DJI Crystal Sky. Everybody loves it. You can stand out. If you can go look at some of the videos I made, you can stand out in direct Texas sunlight. I mean, just sun beaming right on it. And this thing will look as good out in direct sunlight as, um, as your cell phone does sitting in a dark office or something. It's just fantastic unit. But wouldn't it be wonderful if you could combine the technologies of the Autel Evo has to offer the Autel Evo, I should say, ecosystem has to offer with the Crystal Sky. Well, you can. So, what I have is the uh, DJI Crystal Sky uh, bracket mounted to the Evo controller uh, through an adapter, as you can see, and it plugs right into here. And I'm going to just mount this on there and watch the magic happen. There we go. Without me touching anything, it automatically launches the Autel app. Of course, it's going to want me to sign in or whatever. We'll do that later. And you have a fully functional app. As you can see, a nice clear image. You've got maps. If you need maps, I'm not connected to the Wi-Fi or anything. Um, you have maps if you need maps. You, get, you take pictures, video. Everything works as it should, review pictures. I mean, the app is fully functional in here. Now, the one thing that is that is a little caveat is just like everything else that's on the Chris Sky, it doesn't have built-in cell service. So if you need your maps and everything, you have to connect to a Wi-Fi hotspot, but that's just the way that um, all of the Crystal Skies are. Anyway, wanted to share that with you. Again, uh, look forward to sharing some of the videos about the Autel Evo, its capabilities, and, and moreover, the ecosystem. Uh, but I really needed to get this out there. Uh, a lot of people have just love the Crystal Sky, and, and now you can have your cake and eat it too uh, if you like the Autel and, and you really want the Crystal Sky. So anyway, just wanted to, uh, hopefully this helps some of you in, in uh, what you're looking for and the capabilities and everything else, and uh, we'll talk to you later.